Minimum wage increase, not enough. Workers poorer than ever. Adam Soshomole laments. Hello, everyone. Good morning. Welcome back to our channel. It's so good to have you guys back here again. This one is coming from former governor of Edo State, Adam Soshomole. He's lamenting that um, despite uh, the, <laughs> the push for um, minimum wage increase, that that is not enough. We've seen that uh, some states, like Lagos State, some states have gone ahead um, to um, um, release details stating that um, they're going to increase minimum wage in their states. And other states have been told to follow suit to um, follow the take the lead of um, Lagos State and also increase minimum wage in their own states. But right now, Adam Oshomala is stating that even with the minimum wage, that is still not enough. That the sort of hardship and poverty that is in the country, that it's very bad. And he's linking it um, to the national security and even the economic stability. Adam Oshomala is part of the ruling um, party the ruling all progressive congress apc i believe he should be speaking this directly to his principal to the president bola ahmed sinubu because since he came into power things have become very difficult we thought buhari was was not good enough until we met um, bola sinubu it's truly unbelievable these guys they can mortgage the whole country they don't even care for adam Soshomole, um lamenting right now I don't know if this is um, <laughs> something really genuine, but he should he should be able to come up, propose a solution to this, not just lament, because for him, he feels that um, uh, the, the poverty is contributing to the insecurity. Of course, it will contribute to the insecurity because when people don't, when people uh, <laughs> don't see what to eat, they will be pushed to do anything. And that is not what we wish for our, our country. Well, guys, we'll bring all of the details in a bit, all that um, Adam Soshomole um, is saying. But before we do, guys, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, click on the like button. If it's your first time here, you're very, very welcome. Please hit on the subscribe button. God bless you. Now into the details of the report. Former Edo State Governor Adam Soshomole has expressed concerns over wage exploitation in Nigeria, lamenting its impact on national security and economic stability. Speaking on national minimum wage, reward system, and productivity in Africa, he stated that the inadequate wages trigger workers' dissatisfaction and susceptibility to manipulation and radicalization. Oshomole, who was speaking at a recent Distinguished Personality Lecture hosted by the National Institute for Security Studies, NISS, in Abuja, warned that the current economic hardship could lead to social unrest. He further argued that fair wages are essential for boosting productivity and sustaining economic growth. Additionally, he pointed out how inflation has eroded purchasing power leaving many workers financially worse off than previous generations despite nominal increases in minimum wage. He criticized the persistent gap between the lowest and the richest earners in various sectors, which he argued fuels discontent among the working class. Significant disparities exist between minimum and maximum wages across sectors, leading to dissatisfaction among workers the wealthy often benefit from state protection while the poor struggles the minimum wage is designed to protect vulnerable workers but is often not enforced setting minimum wages too high can risk job losses while setting them too low can lead to exploitation inflation severely impacts purchasing power making it difficult for workers to maintain a decent standard of living Historical comparisons show that many workers are poorer now than in the past, despite nominal wage increases, Oshomole said. Oshomole, this, um, all you have just said, um, it's actually correct because um, the minimum wage, we keep hearing it on paper, on news. You know, that's the same thing that um, Obasan just said, that uh, Nigeria has turned into a barrier of policies. 
So they bring a lot of policies to say we're making these changes, we're implementing this, we're going to implement these, but um, actions never match their words. There are no actions. Um, all of those promises, they, all policies, they remain on the table. Even the states that have said um, they are increasing minimum wage, you'll be so surprised that it's not being implemented, maybe for a future date. Adam Soshomole um, is lamenting right now, and what he's actually saying is that workers are even more poorer than ever following um, statistics. But this is under your very administration, the ruling party where you are, and all of this should be channeled to um, your party and your party leader. Your party leader, uh, Bola Tinubu, he's the president of the country, and uh, as such, he is the leader of the party. What is he doing? Because since he came in, he's made life unbearable. Things have become very difficult. Prices of um, food stuff, cost of living has gone up generally and no corresponding wage to match that sort of lifestyle. And Adam Sushomale pointed out something, but this, what he's talking about, if we check it very well, is between the politicians and the masses because he's saying that um, uh, the gap between the minimum wage and the maximum wage is too much. The gap is too high. Uh, it's way too high. Where that gap is, is between the politicians. The politicians, they are in another level. It looks like they are living in another realm, far from um, the ordinary people. They, they are not in touch with reality. Anything we are crying about, anything we are talking about, it doesn't affect them. If it has to do with schooling, um, education, um, name it whatever even the the electricity we're crying about it doesn't affect them is it the petrol price we're, we're lamenting about they don't they don't feel it so this gap he should say it and put it in plain language the gap between the politicians and the ordinary nigerian is is way too much he is saying minimum wage increase is not enough that um, the workers are poorer so minimum wage increase is not enough meaning that what should be done right now? What is the solution um, you are proposing? Propose a solution um, that will um, address this concern you've raised. Probably starting with the lawmakers, cutting down their uh, unnecessary um, bursaries, allowances they get, or drop allowance, why people they are unable to feed. Cutting down the, the wastage, the wastage of funds under um your administration under bola Tinubu, which is your party well guys leave us your take thank you once again for staying tuned please don't forget to like share and to subscribe till i come your way again with more updates bye for now